Now Ewins finds Lambden up the close wall. Takes it over the line. Lambden knocked away from the puck. Ewins there to sweep it up. Goes to Riley in the circle in the middle. Lambden shoots, scores! Two straight games. Logan Lambden opens the scoring. This one on a nice passing play. 5.45 into the matchup. The Everblades have the 1 0 lead. Strong passing. Ewins to Riley to Lambden and into the back of the net. And Bjorklund tied up a little bit out front with Santerno. Couldn't get himself free properly to make that save, but Santerno was not inside the crease, so no goaltender interference. South Carolina takes it. It's Liebold. His pass ahead was looking for Adams. Couldn't get it to him. Adams got it on the wall and just whacks it down the ice. Sharp angle try, and Evans scores. A shot from along the goal line eludes Weber, and the player of the month in February has tied this game up. The Stingrays bringing it back to even. It's 1-1. 15th goal of the season for Johnny Evans. The third year South Carolina Stingray enjoying his best season as a member of this club has already surpassed his point total from all of last year. And that one low along the ice goes off of Weber's skate and into the back of the net. Just a tiny crack along the post makes its way into the back of the net. Or looks like it goes off the far skate and in. Davis trying to steal it away in the far side corner. Gets help from Craig. Craig able to fish that one free. Across the line now, Ewins into the middle. Gets it right back. Ewins in the circle. Takes a shot and he scores. A beautiful bar down rip from Zach Ewins. His second goal of the season gives the Everblades a 2-1 lead with 5.03 to go in the first. A great give and go on that goal. Ewins gets it at the point. Quick pass to Craig. Gets it right back. And that one just one-on-one -on -one against Bjorklund. Challenged him and put it over his glove side shoulder upstairs. Beautiful goal for Zach Ewins. Now has two on the season. And the Florida Everblades out front with just over five to go in the opening period. Looking, his pass as he crosses over the red line, misses the target, but goes in deep to Florida zone. Sam Brooks pass for Nas, taken away, right out front. McGarra wants it, gets it, and he scores. A turnover below the goal line, and Austin McGarra with exactly a minute to go in the first period ties the game. The ECHL's top-scoring rookie gets the goal that evens things up at two in the final minute of the first. Buck just taken away. And no, Lambda not able to get onto McGarra in time. And for Austin McGarra, now 22 goals on the season, 55 points on the campaign, operating at over a point per game pace in his first season with the Stingrays. Off a skate in deep to Florida's end, Stingrays able to make some changes. Buck stolen away, spun into the middle, quick shot, nice save by Weber, his best of the night. Across now, Laudnia scores. A great save from Weber on the first try, but Ivan Laudnia alone in the left circle buries the second opportunity, and the South Carolina Stingrays for the first time tonight have the lead. It's 3-2 for the home club with 9.31 to go in the second period. Laudnia's sixth of the season. A turnover in the corner, out front, great save by Weber off Adams on the first try, and then too many Everblades guys got drawn over into the middle. Laudnia left alone, a heroic effort by Weber, diving back to try and save that one. Got a piece of it with the paddle, but not able to get enough. Stretched across to the right side, South Carolina advances into Florida zone, pushed across, hard shot, and they score. A minute and 21 seconds into the third, the Stingrays find the insurance goal, and it's the first ECHL goal for Ethan Strang in his debut in the pros. He's buried his first and given the Stingrays a 4-2 to two lead. Just a quick play off the rush. Good backhand pass across by McGarra, who has a multi-point game. And that goal certainly going to be memorable for Ethan Strang, 23-year-old out of Cochrane, Alberta. It's Kim advancing for South Carolina. Stop with the puck as he goes over the line. Knocked down. Puck came free. Liebel to shot, and he scores. 
with just five seconds left on the power play. The Stingrays on their first shot are able to break through, and they have a 5-2 lead on the Florida Everblades with 11-16 left to go in the third. 11 goals on the year for the second-year Stingray, Ryan Liebold. That one, him, was taken off the puck. It's just bouncing around. Liebold gets it free. Got a step by Santerno and just goes over the glove side of Weber into the back of the net. And the South Carolina Stingrays now with a commanding lead up three on the Florida Everblades. 